Hey everybody, it's John Fish with another Waste Less Wednesday. So the big holiday for recycling is coming up. America Recycles Day on November 15th. That falls on a Sunday this year. Normally the recycling centers we manage are not open on Sundays, but they will be for America's Recycles Day if you want to come out that day. Make sure you check our website, bridgingthegap.org. Click on Recycle to see what we accept. Uh, and so there's an old saying in recycling that doesn't get repeated often enough these days, and I want to bring it back up again because we're at America Recycles Day almost. And that is, if you're not buying recycled, you're not really recycling. And the point of that is, is it's not enough to separate and put your items into the recycling bin for them to be recycled. You also need to be, whenever possible, seeking out items made from post-consumer recycled material in order to ensure that recycling actually happens. There have to be markets for the materials we put into our recycling bins for them to actually get recycled and have the benefits. Unfortunately, with a lot of things, that's not really feasible because products are not marked. Um, where you have a choice between ones made from post-consumer recycled materials and ones made from new materials. But the main, one that, the main items that you're able to seek out are paper products, things like facial tissue, napkins, paper towels, copy paper, printer paper, that kind of thing, notebooks, that sort of thing. So really look for those post-consumer, and particularly 100% post-consumer where possible, recycled products. We'll pro provide a link in the resources down below to help you find those things. But really look for those because it's absolutely important to buy things made from recycled products to ensure that recycling is successful, that it's viable, that it improves and succeeds over time. So please share this video. We need your help to help people buy recycled. And also make sure you come on out and help us at the recycling centers because we need people out here doing the work with us. We uh, can't provide enough staff to do everything that needs to be done. Go to bridgingthegap.org, click on that volunteer button to find out all the details. If you have any questions about recycling, post them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.